They're the female trio from South London who turned down a record deal with Simon Cowell. Three years on, Stushi have been nominated for awards at the Brits and the Mobos, and they're just about to release their debut album, London with the Lights On. Our entertainment correspondent, Brenda Manis, caught up with them. You used to open doors and I adored you. They are a trio of South London talent whose roots are firmly based in Brixton, Penge and Croydon. But still she admit to being influenced by good old American soul. Why did you let it slip? Bring your love back to me. We've all grown up listening to Motown, different artists from Diana Ross and the Supremes, The Temptations, Martha Reeves, and that just kind of that comes out in, in well, in our songs. You got a black heart. Their single, Black Heart, was nominated for Best British Single at the Brits, and the girls earned themselves a Best Newcomer nomination at the Mobos. Their ever-increasing popularity has also seen them support the likes of rap star Nicki Minaj and Jennifer Lopez. Despite such success, the group are determined to remain grounded. Sushi is really light-hearted, and we've always wanted it to be about that, and just having fun with best friends, just having fun with each other. Meeting fans, or their squad as they're known, is a serious commitment. The good old London bus to promote their album London with the lights on made perfect sense. And is it true that you rejected the big man that you said no to, <laughs> Simon Cowell? Oh, Simon. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He offered us a deal on the spot, but we decided, it was, it was all good, everything's good. I think everyone gets the wrong impression and thinks that we don't talk to Simon anymore and it's all really negative, but it's actually really cool. We saw him the other day and we, yeah, we just ended up not coming to an agreement on the creative control on that. With the demise of Girls Aloud, there is an obvious gap in the market. So are Stushy ready to fill it? We're all doing different things and we, we love being part of the girl power that's going on at the moment. So whatever happens, happens, but we're just happy to be part of it right now. Brenda Manus, BBC London News.